Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lori and today, that's right, we're unboxing something completely different. This is a mystery box per se and it comes from a company. I don't know if you've ever heard of them. I found them on Instagram, the same place where I found Lorella Cosmetics. So this one is Private Society Cosmetics. It comes in this box like this. Now, I'm gonna just warn you right now. When I open this box, it is heavy. There are 16 items in here. So this video is probably going to go fairly long and I apologize for that. I have already unboxed and recorded the very first mystery box I got from them last month in January. This is the February 2020 mystery box. Now, <clears throat> I learned a lesson. Every single item was bubble wrapped and I'm not joking. Every item in this box was bubble wrapped. So in order for me to keep going and not make this video any longer, I what I did was I opened the box and I sat watching TV the other night and I cut all the bubble wrap off the products and I just tossed them back into the box. So believe it or not, I have not seen anything that's in this box. And by that, I just mean I did not sit there and look to see. I took the bubble wrap off, I threw it in the box, closed it up and put it in the corner. So let's dive in because there's a lot and most of them or pretty much none of them are duplicated. So again, it's called Private Society Cosmetics and I'm excited because the first box I fell in love with them. All right. This is one of the things that I do like about them. This is their little logo. It's a key, a plastic key that's attached to their products. And it just makes the packaging very attractive. This is a Pro Wing liquid eye liner and it's the leading liner. So this is what you're getting. The color is brown. So. Like I said, getting into each one of them, some of them I'm gonna make a decision right there on the cuff, whether or not we're gonna open it up and whatever. Pretty much trying to get through this as fast as we can. So here we go. And let's see if, let's see if it kind of clears up in any way, shape or form. Try to roll it. it. Just has gold lettering. It has their logo on there. Sorry, I dropped it, but you know me. If you know and seen my videos before, if I do drop something, I disappear and come back. Like that. <laughs> kind of make a game out of it. Anyhow, it has the, the name Private Society Cosmetics on here in gold. It is, uh, looks like it's silk screen onto the plastic. How would I know that? I used to work for a plastic manufacturing company um, close to where I live. And so I know all about that stuff. It is a nice tip. Let's see, is that easy for you to see? There you go. And then let's go ahead and do this too, as you can see. See how real, per I mean, it just, it just flows. Anyway, there we go. The, oh, the next one. Here we go. Oh, this is this is gonna start getting fun. It's Gloss Boss, and this is the Lipology. Now these were the ones that were hard for me to get open. I didn't figure it out until about. Gosh, I couldn't even. I don't even know. But I wasted a lot of time making the um, the video because I was trying to get into these boxes and didn't realize that I, this is attached to the actual lip gloss. And this one's called Barbie. Okay. So I was sitting here fighting for almost a minute and a half on the other recording, trying to get this thing out and then came to realize that you needed to see this little thing right here. It's a window and the keys pushed through it. You need to push the key back and get the product out. Oh, don't tell me I'm gonna get stuck again. 
Come on. Come on. Oh, I hope this doesn't happen again, please, Lori. I want to show you guys these lip glosses. They are so pretty. Okay, there we go. See? And it did come out in the little tray. That's because of the way it's packaged. But, and I don't think they anticipate us doing unboxing, so it doesn't matter. But this is them. And they are so pretty. So see, this gets stuck in this window. Took me a ton of time, wasted time doing the first video. But I learned about the company doing it. So, you know, you learn by, what do they say? You learn by example. That was me. I'm like, I don't even know where to go. There's so many things in here. All right, this one is lip service as well from the lip service line. And this is a long lasting lip liner. So what color do we have? Bad habit. Let's see right there. Bad habit. Okay. I love it because there's silk screen on their plastic when you know the chambers of where the lip liner is. It can be either this real pretty red or it's that gold or it may be even be like a silver or the, um, uh, what do you call it, the, the rainbow. See? And it is a twist up. Okay, so that is, what color did I say this one was? Bad Habit. I will not be doing any samples of these because we have 16 things to go through. I don't even care about putting them in the box. I'll match them up later. Here is another Perfect Pout Shine and Plump Lip Cover. So this is more than likely um, a lip gloss, the topper. In the color, in the color, clear. This didn't have a color on the bottom. Oh, that's why. This little clear chamber. There's your little doe foot in your... Uh, wand. Okay, so we have that. And lip service from the line Lip Service. Long lasting lip liner in the color Lit. Okay, we're not going to open this one because it's another one, just different colors. Uh, liquid Matte lip this one's called this is from the lip not the lipology lipology was the other one in barbie this is the barbie one this one is the liquid matte lip in lip lock so you can kind of see through there you don't need me to open that up or we're just gonna waste time trust me on this one okay now this was one that i really did like okay it comes it's called amp and it has that rainbow, it's kind of like rainbow tape, but it has that rainbow foil. And this is the High Voltage Electrified Lips Mattitude Metal and Matte Three in One Double Ended Liquid Lip in Showgirl Vegas. So this one has two ends to it. And I did like that. Oh, I'm so excited because I went to their site and when I was ordering this, I didn't know. Um, but I was like, I, I wanted these. I wanted one of these. So I'm excited. You have no idea because I'm learning about this and I just, this is, yeah, this is my second mystery box with them. So look at the colors. I love this. Let's see, what were they? Showgirl and Vegas, and it's hard to tell which one's which. It doesn't say on here which one's which. All that tells me is it's from the AMP lip line. Oh, yes. All right, I'm gonna use that. I will be trying that. Okay, more. 
Okay, leading liner, a pro wing liquid eyeliner in black. So you have this in black. All right, keep going. Um, from Gloss Boss, yes, we already have the Lipology. This one is plush. So it's the same as the one that we opened first, which is this one. This one is plush. So if you can see through that little window there, if you can, that's the color. Oops, it's down there. We're not gonna get it. I will later, but not now. But if you can see through that little window, that's the color that is in that box. Still got some more. Okay, liquid matte lip, just like the one that we had before in Salty. Okay, this one is Cabana, and this one is a lip lock from the lip lock line. So that's a Cabana, and as you can see, it's a pink. Okay, that's a pink. Wow. And this one, the Salty, ooh, I like, I like the Salty. The pink might be fun to play with. Double-ended contour stick. Okay, and this is uh, from the Contour Confidential line. So, see that there? Okay, and it didn't say anything about colors. I have received one of these in the box prior. I do have another box coming, I believe. I know I have more Lorellas. Oh, and by the way, just to give you a little heads up, the Lorella Cosmetics, The I have two more boxes to unbox. And then I just ordered today, instead of box one and two, I ordered box two and three, the big boys. So that's gonna be exciting. I should have them within a week. Okay. Well, oh, these are, oh, I was gonna say these are dark, but no. It seems like, okay, we might have dark. This is a double-ended contour stick and it does not have colors, but kind of get the gist of it. See that? It's gonna do its job. And then this other end, I do like the fact that it's, that it's a soft color. This would actually match and do some really good stuff to my face. Oh, I like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this would have helped tonight a lot. You know, that's not bad. I put that in my purse. On the go. Staycations, here I come. Husband's um cashing out some more vacation time, so the next few weeks, he's going to have three-day vacations. So, not, we're not leaving town, but we're leaving town to go, like, eat and take the puppies to the beach and stuff and go on long walks. All right, this is the Get Set Face Powder, and it's a setting powder. Now, I did, I'm pretty sure, I'll have to check, but I'm pretty sure I got this in the last box. I'm not positive. I'm not 100% sure. And the setting powders are different color. So, I'll try to get this open. I am really glad that I learned from my other, wish I had a pencil here. So I could get this box open. I don't have my chopsticks with me. You know, they get these boxes open without damaging them just in case I want to pass these on to somebody. Okay, this is the Get Set Face Powder and it's a pretty decent sized little container. The little jar has their logo on the front, their PS for Private Society, and then just like this. So it doesn't necessarily tell you a color. It's going to have that plastic, you know, that sticker on there. Yeah. So, kind of, it, it's a warm, has some yellows, 
you can see the yellow in there almost like that uh, i don't know i can't remember off the top of my head who makes it but it's the banana setting powder see this is where i'm going to get get you guys engaged remember in conversation in the comment section down below it is a banana setting powder and i can't remember who makes it and if you get beauty box subscriptions you probably know who because i can tell you right now i probably have not spent more than a couple hundred dollars total on all the makeup that i have and i'm gonna do a video and i'm gonna take you through everything i have including my skincare okay that's it for these little boxes like this the lipologies the lip locks the amp the uh contour confidential the lip service the uh perfect pout um where are they the leading liners i'm sorry i'm just like there's Three, four, seven, ten. There's eleven boxes sitting right here. I'm not going to pick them all up, but I'm just going to kind of show you that this is how many things we got. All right. Now, and one's on the floor. <laughs> it's going to stay there. All right. So now you get three of these, okay? They're pretty decent size. This is just showing you that this is the first one and this is called the Key Essentials and it's a total face palette. So kind of has your highlighter, your bronze, your translucent powder, your blush. So you, and I was right. One translucent powder, a blush, a bronzer, and a highlighter. Okay, so you do get a pretty nice little palette here and I'm not worried if I break a nail because I've had these nails on for quite a while now and I to be honest with you they were a pain in the butt from the first time I put the set on and did them the little um, you know, where they call them the raised effect on a nail that has all of these little things. I never did them before. I always thought they were a pain in the butt, especially when you're doing certain things, i.e. going to the bathroom. <laughs> I thought they'd get caught on everything or shampooing your hair. You just hair all over your nails. They actually don't. I thought they were going to be a problem with the baby and me babysitting when my daughter's doing her uh, schoolwork. They don't. The only problem that I had with them was the length and I did them as stilettos way really long and I ended up having to cut off about a quarter inch. I really wish they would have stayed that way but in all reality when I was going like this make sure that the file and the shape and everything was the way it's supposed to be. I always do this, scratch myself. I really didn't like that sharp, sharp edge. I just didn't, I didn't. So I'm actually glad I cut them down and turned them into almond slash coffin. So just safe shape for watching a baby and doing stuff like this. All right. If you will notice, and I'm because I'm going to show you, it'll say volume one right here. So that leads me to believe because this is the first time that I'm coming across this company and sharing it with you. So when I saw that, I told my daughter, look, volume one. I said, that means that as these mystery boxes are continued to be offered to us, that means we're going to get a volume two volume three and that's of each line I figure maybe the uh, total face palette might have another type of combination of 
you know, because these colors can't just, you know, they, they're going to go with only a specific type of skin tone. You got to have it for all skin tones. You know, what if you have a really dark skin tone? That color's not going to really go very well. So anyway, here it is. And I do like this part of the package. You know me. That magnetic opening. Okay. And then... Again, P.S. Face it, you're gorgeous. <laughs> See that right there, my tray. There you go. P.S. Face it, you're gorgeous. All right. And then it is attached. I love it. Love it. And this, oh, come on, you guys. Look at this palette. I mean, seriously not just for the packaging. I mean, they did a phenomenal job. Hopefully I didn't stick my nails in any of them. Nope. But I mean, look at this. Beautiful. I would swatch them, but not gonna do it. And then look at right here, look at, cause on the plastic it had the key. That's gorgeous. All right, I'm just gonna pop this back in there couple more and we're already on 21 minutes so let's keep going this looks like an envelope it reminds me of an invitation because that's basically what it is it's a private society name of the company that's catchy especially for marketing private society cosmetics looks like an envelope basically it says if you research them and look up uh, look them up and read about them it's kind of like we're inviting you into a unique club and this one's called, ooh, I didn't, I don't have this. I did not get this in the last mystery box. Bad bitch. Nice. I thought it lifted up. I told my daughter and she's like, don't ruin it. I go, I won't, I won't. But I really do wish I had a, um, a uh, pair of scissors and I didn't bring any, I didn't. Like I said, I did not look at these. I just took the bubble wrap off because the last one was almost an hour. I mean, it was 50 minutes opening because of all the bubble wrap. Every single one of them was bubble wrapped. I mean, they are serious about protecting their product that they're passing on to you. All right, look at this. This little thing in there. Oh my God, look at this palette. That is so cool. See the back? Okay, this has 12 primer infused eyeshadows. Check this out. See the colors, oh my. This is more up my alley, you know? Like if you're family or friend and you know me, that's pretty much up my alley if I was gonna wear colors because for the most part, I'm not a makeup person. You know, growing up and everything like that, my sisters did makeup, I didn't. And I used to always like to be the one in the background, you know, in the shadow, not saying anything, watching them. At the big vanity, they used to go into my dad's bathroom and had the two double sinks, huge long counter, and the entire wall was a mirror. These girls would line up with their makeup and put it on, and I used to sit back in the shadows and watch. And just, you know, I was envious, you know? It's like, how pretty when they do all this stuff, you know, get all, put all the different colors on there. All right, here's something else too, and it is coming out. It's sliding, you know, me and my protector. But again, see, maybe Bad Bitch has more coming out. Hopefully the line will have volume two, three, four, and so on. But see, unlock your beauty, hence the key to all their stuff. It has the magnetic. Nice. P.S. Be too glam to give a damn. Let's see if I can get that. Yeah, right there. 
Okay, let me see if I can get it the same way I did the other one so you guys can see that. Oh, there you go. There you go. Okay, anyway, etched in the, not etched, but actually silk screened on the stamped. It's a stamp sticker. And then these are the colors. It does come with a double-ended little brush right there that has Bad Betch on it. But these colors are gorgeous. That I will do a look when I'm doing and making a video for you guys. So that'll be a lot of fun. I can already tell the colors that, you know, where my base color is going to be, my um, outer corner, inner corner, the void that, you know, you put your finger, and get the glitter on there. That's, I'm already there. I already know what's going to happen. <laughs> oh my God, it's late and I'm like getting delirious, but I really want to get through as many of these as I possibly can, even if it means sleeping in tomorrow, who cares? Okay, one more and then we are done. 26 minutes, I think I'm making it. Here we go. What does that say? Ooh, Secret Admire. This one's big. I did not get a, like a, I got a big one. We got two of these. I got one of these in my other one. And I'm going to post the video, even if it is 50 minutes, and just, you know, bear with me. You can move forward on it anytime you want. But you got one about the size of this, and it was called Amp. Um, where is it? Like this? It was from this line with the Amp. It was called Amped Up, I think. I'll take a look at it. But it was just a little bigger than this one here. This is big secret admire and it's upside down lord have mercy there we go secret admire look at how pretty the drip and then the private society logo god they sure do know how to package what is this it's a blush palette oh thank you very much p.s oh come on do i have anything over here that will open this without tearing the package and I don't want to tear the package because they are so pretty and at the same time I do have other <laughs> you saw all those boxes over there so I'd like for these nails to last without popping one off look at on the back it's so pretty Looks like it has eight. Yeah, it has eight different, eight different, um, come on. Okay, and I guess I don't want to ruin these. These boxes are beautiful. Okay. Oh, look at, look at all the shifting colors. They shift with the light. I love it. That is so pretty. All right. Oh, P.S. You guys did great. And it's attached like I love. Okay, on the mirror, we're not going to try to do anything with the glare and the time. It says, P.S. You make me blush. Tu me fa rougir. I'm guessing French. <laughs> <laughs> to me fa it's a different lang that's language that's all I can tell you see right here let's see yeah so anyway and then this is attached and it does have amp and amp which is the line that I had from my prior box so okay ooh First Kiss, Daydreaming, Rose Petals, Pinky Swear, Infatuation. Oh, how many of you had that back in grade school? <laughs> Bashful, Sweet Romance, and Coral Crush. Well, Sweet Romance, no, that didn't happen until high school. I had crushes on a lot of guys, but they weren't the same. It 
was not reciprocated. Okay, look at these colors. And these are blushes. I mean, to be honest with you, remember what I said, zero rules in makeup. You can put this on anything you want. So I see some colors that I may even add on my base for my eyeshadow. And I mean, take a look at it. These are just little ideas, you know, like over here, you know, like over here, all these right here. So these five I see as, you know, the base for an eyeshadow and then start building from there, pull out or blend in, you know, but I don't know who would wear Coral Crush as a blush. I mean, if I was to, I'm actually wearing, um, is it Laura Geller? Yeah. Laura Geller. And she has this dome blush and it looks like white, you know, all marbled inside. Oh man, when I found that blush, that was it. And that's pretty much the only blush that I wear because it is so perfect. And it has the iridescence of highlight inside of it, mixed it in. So it does this at the same time. And I know you can't see it with my glasses because they're in the way, but it does add. And then I use a um, uh, contour for right there. I have a natural indentation on both sides, so it helps. Anyway. I'm going to play with these sparkles and I'm going to play with a couple of these mattes and do a look. And I'll let you know. I'll always let you know what I used. All right. That's it. We got this cute Secret Admire blush palette. We received the Bad Betch and this is the eyeshadow palette. It has 10, 12, 12 pans. And they're the nude natural earth tones. We received the key essentials, which is the total face palette. Your uh, translucent powder, your blush, your bronzer, and your highlighter. So that came in this one here. Basically, your your essentials. It's what you need. Right? Makes your face pretty. And as long as we like it, that's all that matters. Okay, your setting powder. Let's see, one, two. I'm not going to put that one in because it's on the floor. But how many? Four. We got this one that fell on the floor. And then you have one, two, three. So we got four of these. We got lip service. Let me see how many there are here. Um lips perfect pop okay there are let's see is that in there I want to make sure before I shut it uh, these are along the lines of like this is says lip service and perfect pout so here's a shine and plump lip cover long lasting lip liner lip liner there's three uh, the mattitude high voltage Electric lips, electrified lips. This is the double-ended liquid lip. That's by itself. The double-ended contour stick. One. A pro wing liquid eyeliner. One. Oh no, two. Uh, pro wing liquid eyeliner. So remember, we got a brown and we got a black. So two of those. And then the one sitting on the floor, which makes them four. All right. I hope you enjoyed this video. We're almost at 35 minutes. I'm going to end it right now. Move on to the next box. Please give this video a thumbs up. Hit your subscribe button. Turn on your notification bell so you know when I upload the next video. Because it's going to be one of these guys over here. And I will see you. You know in the next video. Bye. Have a good evening too. Wherever you are, it might be morning, afternoon, night, whatever. Good morning, good afternoon, or good night. Bye. And stay tuned, okay?